Hello and welcome, it's Emily Thorpe from happyworkingmum.com and just uh, wanting to give you video 3 in my series of How to Ditch the Guilt. So for a quick recap, video 1 was about how guilt makes you feel bad. It uh, doesn't serve you, it doesn't feel good and it can also skew your parenting skills so you do things maybe you wouldn't do normally. Video 2 was all about why we feel guilty, so it was the triggers that um, bring up that feeling and it's usually because you've got a belief or a rule about what a good mum should be or what a good mum should do and when you don't live up to those expectations you feel bad. But the great news is you can rewrite those rules and then you'll feel good all the time. The third video today then is a couple of top tips to help you really um, annihilate that guilt. So I want you to think about a decision or something that makes you feel guilty and I want you to flip it round. So for example if you feel guilty about going back to work then flip it round and think of all the benefits or all the pluses to you going to work. It could be that you're bringing an extra income into the household, it could be that your job is very rewarding and satisfying, you enjoy talking to your colleagues and um, having that buzz at work. It could be that you feel guilty about dropping your child off at nursery, in which case flip that round and think what are the benefits of my child going to nursery. So for example they are enjoying being with other people, with other grown-ups who love looking after kids, they're interacting with other little you know children and they're learning all these um, social skills and they're also learning how to build bonds with other people, how to trust other people and um, share and love which is basically what life is all about. It's a great life skill to be able to um, build these bonds with other people apart from their near family. Um, the second top tip is to always have gratitude in mind. So going back to the job example, you know, be thankful that you have a job because so many people don't. Be thankful that you've got a nursery that, you know, that they look after your child well and your child is loved and cared for. Um, there's always a plus side, there's always a way of twisting things around so that you can see the benefits and, you know, give yourself a break and I really want you to um, embrace these guilt-free tips because there's really no need, it, it, it doesn't serve you and you'll be such a happier mum with your children, you'll be a happier person at work um, without the guilt weighing you down, you'll feel light and free and um, it's fabulous. So I hope you've enjoyed these tips and um, I'd like to speak to you soon. Take care and please visit my site um, happyworkingmum.com or like me on Facebook. Okay, take care, bye.